So I'm here today reviewing this chair and it is pretty nice, I gotta say. I got another Mimo chair here. Um, this one, the armrest folds up and you know, everyone that sits on it's like, wow, this chair is kind of, it's kind of just a chair. But this one is much more comfortable. Uh, I wish I had gotten this one instead, honestly. The only complaint I have about it is the wheels here aren't good on carpet, but you throw down a pad or something to roll this on and you'd be good to go. Whereas these wheels, pretty solid on carpet as is. These ones, a little bit of efforts there. Uh, this one's really nice because it's got adjustable height here. This seat slides up and back. I wish it slid back a little more, but it does slide up. So I'll just lift that up. And then this slides forward if you pull on it. Uh, it does recline, so that's nice. It's back, I think, at a 135 degree angle or something like that. Um, this one is just solid. The lumbar support's really nice on this, too. The back took me a little bit getting used to first. What you do is you pull it up, and when you get to the top, it resets. So, one, two, three, four. That's the position I like, but that's really easy to do. Headrest. Good as well, you can adjust that some. Armrests come up, go back down. It probably took me about 40-ish uh, minutes to put it together. Uh, it was pretty easy to do by myself. There was one part that was troublesome though, where luckily I had someone over at the house who was helping me with it, and that was putting the these two pieces together, the back of the chair and the base of the chair. But, I mean, that was still pretty easy if you propped it up against something. Just both those pieces are kind of heavy. So, that took a little bit of work. But overall, it's a, it's a great chair. Again, only complaint with it is the wheels don't roll too well on carpet. But, I mean, I got a little floor mat in the corner. I'll take care of that. But, yeah, great chair. Definitely worth the money. This one... Definitely worth the money, too. This was like a $100 chair. This is like a $300 chair. Um, this one fits my needs pretty well. It's a great office chair. It kept, kept me focused because the back didn't go on. So, I mean, it's still a great product. But it's a $100 product versus a $300 product. And this one is definitely going to keep me more comfortable throughout the workday. Love the lumbar support. Um, and, yeah. Hope you do, too. So this Samofu ergonomic chair... It's first and foremost just really, really sleek, has a nice mesh look all around. It's very stable. I don't see any faults in terms of the stability and also all the functionalities. And so let's get into all of the functions. So, well, first of all, the mesh chair is extremely supportive. Uh, there's no faults here. I'm 180 pounds and this is totally fine for me. It's very solid, very good. The armrest is adjustable and very sturdy. Um, you know, you have the backrest height adjustment that you can do, and that's really, really solid. Um, and then you also have, you, know, you can adjust your seat. So you can adjust it to you know, go look forward or backwards, and it's very easy. You can also, of course, adjust the height of the seat so it becomes you know, a lot taller or shorter, however you want. The headrest is very stable, and you can also adjust that. Basically, you can adjust this chair to however tall or short you are. It's very solid, very stable, and for anyone who's looking for a good office chair, highly recommend.